Members of the GOP convene every four years for a national convention to fundraise, rally, and celebrate its party's presidential pick. In years past, it's been a who's who of Texas's Republican leadership. Come Monday in Cleveland, a few faces will be noticeably absent from the crowd. Let's start at the top. Early last week, a spokesman for Governor Greg Abbott confirmed he would be at the Republican National Convention all week long. Sunday, news surfaced that Abbott had suffered, quote, second and third degree burns when he was accidentally scalded with water while on vacation in Wyoming. Monday, his office revealed he'd be undergoing skin grafts to repair damage, and his schedule remained up in the air. Lieutenant Governor Dan Patrick is confirmed to attend, as is House Speaker Joe Strauss and Attorney General Ken Paxton. Texas's senior Senator John Cornyn will be there, as will his junior counterpart Ted Cruz. Cruz, a former opponent of the GOP's presumptive presidential nominee, Donald Trump, is confirmed to speak next week. Former Texas Governor Rick Perry will also be there. Those not catching a flight to Ohio include Comptroller Glenn Hager, Ag Commissioner Sid Miller, and Land Commissioner George P. Bush, whose dad Jeb Bush was among the presidential candidates Trump defeated in this year's primaries. Regardless of which Texas officials show up, an RNC with Trump at center stage, we will make America great again, promises to deliver a grand old party. This is Alana Rocha reporting for the Texas Tribune.